Sandra, you're back. Got to run, sorry. Wait, where? I'll be right back. See you at the Spacias. Sometimes I think you are too much like me. Friends, I know you're angry. And you have the right to be. Why do they hide in their houses and not quell the chaos that come to Athens? Understand? Aspasia. Oh, Cassandra. You returned to Athens. What's left of Athens? The world we've built is crumbling at our feet. It's as loud as a battlefield out there, and as violent. They're calling for Pericles' head, as though he should know how to handle this catastrophe. No one is prepared for the end of the world. I came to talk to you. I found out some things about my mother. Her name, her ship... Cassandra, it's not the time. Pericles is dying. He won't see me. He won't let Hippocrates in his room. He only babbles about going to his precious Parthenon. Pericles is a strong man. I'm sure he can fight the sickness. You heard the mob. He can't defend himself. He'll die with no glory. Athens has known him a lot longer than they've known this plague. He gave them a voice. His accomplishments will speak for him. <sighs> Pericles needs treatment, and the gods know he won't let me in. He respects you. Could you go to him? I could try. If you do, I will make the time to talk about your mother. For now, he needs your help. It's worth a shot. Sandra. Yes. Come in. It's embarrassing. Someone so strong seeing me like this. You look healthy as ever. Tell Aspasia that. She won't worry so much about me. I brought your drugs. Ah, yes. It's usually Phoebe who does the delivering. At least I'm alive. Though I can't say the same for my city. 
It's a shadow of what it was. Well, it will belong to Cleon now. He will have to lift it out of its sorry state. Ah. Ah. I wish to see it with my own eyes. Come to the balcony. Much has changed. I can't even stand up straight to look death in the eye. You'll recover sooner if you let Hippocrates see you. It's my time. The plague chooses no favorites. I fear I've failed Athens. Its people? Aspasia? No, you haven't. Ah, you're kind, but I've lost. Aspasia needs protection, as does Athens. I thought I gave enough to Athena, but it seems it isn't so. I should be out there, on the streets. You'd be overtaken. There are mobs, and Cleon's doing nothing to calm them. Thank the gods, Cleon won't see me like this. But that's all I can thank the gods for. They've turned on me. It's not the gods' fault. It's the world. It's turned upside down. Athens' fate is decreed. All we can do now is wait. You should go back inside. You need to rest. Where I should be is in the Parthenon. My greatest legacy to Athens. We need the gods' blessing. But Aspasia... Aspasia's right. She often is. But not about this. Yes. I'll go inside. Thank you, Cassandra. Tell my Aspasia I was a good boy and took my drugs. I will. Please let me in. He took his drugs without complaint. Thank you. Something wrong? I expected Phoebe back by now. I saw her in the crowds outside. Did you send her somewhere? I had her go to Anastasios to see about a ferry. As soon as Pericles is strong enough, we're leaving Athens. We have to. But now she's missing. I'm sure she's all right. Did Pericles tell you what I said about the cult in Athens? This cult? I thought it was his sickness speaking for him. It's true. But Phoebe's smart. She knows the way back. I hope so. I'm going to look for her. Where is Anastasios' house? It's across from the Odeon of Pericles. Here. Come 
bounty on your head, you spy! <laughs> This area will be well defended. This looks like the place. Ella. here Demos must be carrying through on his threat I'm glad Phoebe wasn't here hopefully she's safe this was savage done to send a message
Mother of all, I greet you. Aniazu. Cassandra! Are you all right? I need to speak to Aspasia. We must find Pericles first. He's missing. I don't fucking care! Tell me where Aspasia is! Cassandra! I'm sorry, baby. Aspasia went to find Pericles at the Parthenon. She should be there. I think we'd better go with her. I agree, my friend, I agree. <laughs> <laughs> 